close your eyes. Take a couple of long, <coughs> good, long, deep in and out breaths. And see how it feels. Try to breathe all the way down through the torso so the breath can energize the body and provide a good place for the mind to stay. This is important because the shape of your mind determines where you're going. As the Buddha said, there are four kinds of people, people who come in darkness and go in darkness, people who come in light and go in light, people who come in darkness and go in light, and people who come in darkness, light and go in darkness. And of course we want to go in the direction of the light. That means the mind has to be trained. Because otherwise it gives in to its, its moods all the time, and then, but the things you do through your moods are not all that reliable. You want to have your decisions based on mindfulness and alertness and clear discernment of which is the bright path and which is the dark path. Coming in darkness means that you're born in a poor family, you're born with difficult conditions. You may not be good looking, your parents don't practice the virtues. In other words, you start out with a really difficult place. Coming in light, of course, means that you're born in a wealthy family, the parents are virtuous, opportunities for education are easy, things come easily to you. And the direction from which you come is not all that important. I mean, it does help that, that you have parents who are virtuous, because they show you the path that goes to brightness. In other words, the path I mean, going in the direction of the light means observing the precepts, training the mind, making sure that your behavior is harmless, and that you're, you're generous with other people, you train the mind in a good direction so you can overcome your greed, aversion, and delusion as much as you can. That's what it means to go in, light, in, in the direction of the light. Going in darkness means that you break the precepts, you're not virtuous, in other words, you just pile more bad karma on top of yourself. So the extent that which we have come from the light, part of that we owe to the virtue of our parents. When today we're, they say it's Father's Day. Well, today is Father's Day as much as any other day is Father's Day. Just like today is Mother's Day and any other day is Mother's Day. You have to remember the virtues of your parents all the time. Because they've set you in the right direction to the extent that they are virtuous. But then you have to look at your own life. You can't depend on your parents forever. You've got to make your own way. And which way are you going to make? Are you going to go in the direction of the light or are you going to go in the direction of the darkness? That's your choice. And it's important to realize that we do have the choice. Life isn't totally determined. Your choices make all the difference in the world. So every time you're about to do or say or think something, ask yourself, which direction is this going to turn you in? As the Buddha once said, he once divided his thoughts into two types, the types that were motivated by sensual, sensual passion, ill will, harmfulness on one side, and those that were motivated by renunciation, goodwill, and harmlessness on the other side. Notice when he divided his thoughts, he didn't divide them as to whether they were smart or not smart. He didn't talk about the content, he was talking about where do these things go? Well, they come from the different motivations, and the motivation is determined where these thoughts are going to lead. So learn to step back from your thoughts and ask yourself, which direction are these things leading? And then try, try to choose the direction of the light, because as I said, ultimately it doesn't really matter which direction you come from. What really matters is where you're going. And that's up to you. So try to train the mind as much as you can so that it stays steadily on the path that leads to brightness. And don't let the path to darkness tempt you off the, off the bright path.